Hell at Loose is getting night maps and flare guns coming with update 12. War doesn't always occur during the day hours, and in fact, tactics can be used at night under the cover of darkness for surprise attacks. Insurgency Sandstorm is currently running night map PvP for a limited time mode, and let me tell you, it is refreshing to have something new, especially on console. I want these night maps PvP to be a permanent mode. The night maps bring a different atmosphere and you have to play differently, a little bit more tactical from your daytime maps. With the mindset of adding additional realism to the game, night maps will focus low light mood set between 6pm and 6am. Some maps will have a lighter feel, while others will feel like the dead of night. The developers want to spread the mood of lighting variations for variety, and in some cases enhance playability and atmosphere. Here are some pictures of maps to have a low lighting mood effect. Flare guns were used in World War II where radio silence was important to send a signal or reveal their position if under distress. Three flare guns will be added. The German Ledschup Pistol 42, the Soviet SPSH 42, and the American AN-48. This will be delegated to the spotter of each faction with only a single flare. Choose wisely when you want to use a flare gun. At the moment, the flare will be a permanent use for the spotter during daylight and night maps, but is subject to change. Flares will be used as a reconnaissance tool to mark enemy positions within 50 meter radius for a period of 30 seconds. The commander will have the ability to call this in, which is similar to the recon plane for day maps. Allied flares will be green and access will be red to identify the active flare. Update 12 is coming this year and should be coming to console the same time PC received this update. Hell at Loose on console has a lot to look forward to and it's a matter of being very patient. We still have yet to receive any new content and only one quality of life update since its release. Console players desperately need some new content alongside with bug fixes. Anyways, I'm looking forward to these night maps. It'll be refreshing to have something new. Also, a beta test for the Remigan map should be happening in the next two weeks. As far as I'm aware, this includes console, but I'm not 100% sure. Check the Hell at Loose Discord for information if you want to participate. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Peace.